Welcome to Miss Smith's Math Tutorials. I'm Miss Smith. In this video, we're going to be talking about area of a sector, which is pretty easy to find as long as you have the formulas memorized. There are two separate formulas we're going to look at. One if you've been given your information in a degree, and one if you've been given your information in a radian form. Degrees and radians are just two different ways to measure angles, and you're probably going to see both, so we want to make sure we memorize both formulas. The first formula works with degree. And what area of a sector is, is basically if we have a circle and we have a certain section or sector of the circle and we wanna know the area of that part. So notice how I've shaded the section we wanna know the area of. So that's called a sector. So area of a sector is pretty easy to find. You only need to know the degree and the radius and we just follow the formula. So I'm just gonna write area equals the degree, which is 80, divided by 360, times pi, times r squared. r squared is the radius, so that's the distance from the edge of the circle to the center of the circle, which it tells us here is 4 centimeters. So we want to multiply that pi by 4 squared. And then what's great is you can just type that straight into the calculator. So if you bring out your calculator and we typed in parenthesis 80 divided by 360, and that tells your calculator it's a fraction you've got, times pi times 4 squared. And that leaves us with 11 point and then a really long decimal. So let's just round this to the nearest hundredth. So that would be 11.17. Our area of the sector is 11.17 and then our units centimeters and then what's really important is that it's actually centimeters squared and the reason it's centimeters squared is because we're finding the area but it's the area of a 2d figure isn't this like a 2d flat shape it's not a sphere it's just a circle so that's why it's centimeters squared it's a 2d shape we're finding the area of Okay, let's find the area of a sector when we've been given a radian measurement. So notice this one, now we're wanting to find um, not the little small pie piece, but rather this whole shaded area of the circle, right? This sector right here. So we're gonna follow the same type of steps, just this time our formula is different. So this time the formula is 1 half times r squared. Again, r is that radius, which here it told us is 3 feet times the radian. So 3 pi over 2 is our radian. So we would write that as area equals 1 half times radius squared. So 3 squared times the radian, which is 3 pi over 2. And again, your calculator can do this for you if you bring it out. So we've got a 1 half times 3 squared times parenthesis 3 pi over 2. And that gives us a 21.21 if we round to the nearest hundredth. So let's write that answer. So our area, in this case, our area of the sector is 21.21. And remember, it's our units is feet, but we're finding area of a 2D shape, so it's feet squared. Okay, here's two for you guys to try. I will post the answers in the video description below. This has been Miss Miss Math Tutorials.